most sophisticated Mars rover ever built is on its way to the Red Planet. That's right, and CBS News' Kyra Finstrom is live at JPL in Pasadena with a look at this morning's launch and more on its mission. Kyra, good morning. Good morning, DeMarco. That was built right here. It is the beloved baby of JPL, so lots of pride on this campus today. Let's get right to the launch this morning from Cape Canaveral, Florida. Zero. Release. The SUV-sized rover Perseverance billed as the most technologically advanced machinery ever sent to Mars. Its mission, a big one, search for evidence of ancient life. The rover will and, uh, drill into the planet's surface, look control. for signs of long-dead microscopic organisms that may have thrived on Mars billions of years ago. Its other goal, to study the climate and the geology of Mars. And we've got some video of Perseverance we want to show you. This is a first-of-its-kind helicopter of sorts. It's going to be able to capture aerial views of the planet's surface. It is also equipped to collect samples of Martian rock, which will one day be returned to Earth. And Aaron Yazi is joining us live here. He is a mechanical engineer, and you had a part of building this uh, collection of rocks uh, equipment that the rover is equipped with. That's right. It's been a wild ride. I've been working on this project for the past four years about, and this morning it was incredible to watch it launch to Mars. Um, the system that we've worked on is a giant sample caching system that this rover will use to carefully select interesting science rocks where we hope will hold the history to Mars and show us uh, signs of, of ancient life on Mars. Just amazing to think about. February of next year is when this is due to land on Mars, but your work here <laughs> well underway this morning. That's right. This the, For us here at JPL, it really kicks off a, another phase of the project, and there's a whole other team coming in who have already been working very hard and will continue to work all throughout the cruise until it, it gets to Mars in February. The landing event in February is another big event that we're getting really excited about. Um, there'll be another big team here, another big event, people on console to watch that. I'm sure there'll be a watch party, and I'm sure there'll be more news to, to share then. And for the kids at home that are watching this, just fascinating for them, the idea of life possibly on another planet. Uh, growing up yourself, I mean, did you ever think you'd be involved in something like this, such a big mission that could provide so many answers? Oh, I, I've wanted big things for myself for a long time, but I never thought that it would lead to a role like this on a mission like this. And it's been so cool to be able to work with such brilliant people on such a historic mission. Um, the people that I work with have been on past incredible historical missions, the Curiosity Rover, the Mars Exploration Rovers, and they are my mentors. It's, it's incredible to work here. All right. Thanks so much for joining us. DeMarco, Suzanne, love the mask as well this morning. <laughs> Thank All you, right. Cara. Thank you very much. I'm fanning because See, we just got another uh, aftershock, yeah. Cara.